How do you feel about going to the grocery store? Love it. I mean, it's not the cool grocery store that you do, you go to, but it's cool. Do you really like it or do you hate it? I love going to the store. I think it's awesome. Jay Coles in our news department uh, loves going there. I love the store. I, and I go there like five times a day. <laughs> you, no joke. Kids are eating you out of house and home. I know a lot of people think it's a chore, though, too. Yeah, it, it's, it is true. Uh, Donald and Liz love it so much. They create a Facebook page celebrating not only the stores, but more importantly, the people who work there. Kelly Hansen introduces us to these best friends who are celebrating the grocery store industry one post at a time. Oh Look over here, God. the seafood, like with the little neck clams and mussels. Meet the grocery store fanatics. Well, one of the things we like to do is feature different things. And right here, we're at the Scoops ice cream right in the bakery of Kowalski Z. Dina. So you and can get an ice cream scoop? Yes. In a grocery store? Yes. This is new and different, and that's what you like to highlight. Yes. Oh, when we go to grocery stores, and especially, like, people are always innovating and changing and, and bringing in new exciting things, and to have scooped ice cream yeah. called Scoops right here at, uh, at Kowalski G. Diner. You can awesome. walk around with a scoop of ice cream yes. on the grocery shop. Yes. It's pretty great. I don't know. This caramel sea salt is calling my name. Can I get, like, a tiny, do it. tiny do it, something? Do it. <laughs> what do you think? Right? right. Yeah. You know yes. everything. You both know everything there is to know about well, it's grocery about stores. The people. Yes. You say hello to the people. You say, what's your story? How'd you get to be that way? What'd you do? You know Joe. Yeah, you know Joe. Joe. Yes. Assistant this bakery is Joe. manager. <laughs> Donald and Liz celebrate what makes a grocery store run every single day on their Facebook page. Donald, you started Grocery Store Fanatics and it has blown up on Facebook. Is it shocking to you how many people follow your page? Yes, it is very shocking. What do you think about it? Love it. <laughs> love that everybody's interested about, you know, the grocery store industry. Why do you love grocery stores so much? I love like the layouts, the signage, you know, all that type of stuff to make the, all that come alive, basically. Donald met Liz at a grocery store, of course. Came to the store and she gave me a tour and gave me some cookies and just did the whole thing. And then we just became friends automatically. Nine years later, we are still friends. Best friends, Liz. Best friends. Oh, I would say so, yeah. He's like executed his vision of, of creating a platform for the celebration of grocery stores. And it's a vision that's evolved, but Donald's very tenacious in making sure that people stay connected to the platform. People have taken to it. Uh, the grocery store, we often take the grocery store for granted, but Donald has really created a wonderful place to shine the spotlight on the importance of the grocery store, like you say, in the yes, community. Exactly. Hi, Fanatics. There's another 360 view just from the upstairs seating area. You can look down below, bird's eye view. Their Facebook page isn't a review or a critique. It's a celebration of new stores opening, the different departments you'll find, and the people. One thing you do on your Facebook page is called the Fried Chicken Challenge. Yes. yes. How does this work? It's all to celebrate a grocery store staple, fried right. chicken. We don't cook it at home. No. Where do we get it? At the grocery You're store. Right. This is like an easy dinner. Can we get some chicken legs, please? <laughs> Okay, take a bite. Take a bite. Okay. It's hot. Well, this is how it goes. Donald? Is it hot? Yes. yes. Is it fresh? Yes. yes. Is it delicious? Yes. 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 Kowalski Z. Dinah, you, you passed, passed the, the fried chicken, chicken challenge. Woo. <laughs> this is great. Cheers. Cheers. One more Cheers. bite. Yes. You met anyone? that loves grocery stores as much as Donald. Not at all, <laughs> he's way at the top. <laughs> Employees like Tina at the brand new Kowalski's at Southdale light up when these fanatics walk in. Donald also works here. Yes. Tell me about that. He does. He works on our front end. He um, started carrying out and then he went to cashier and now most recently he's super excited and he will let you know <laughs> that he sometimes supervises the self checkouts and that means doing voids, helping customers with their transactions, and he just loves it. Is he kind of a celebrity in the grocery store world? Absolutely. <laughs> Anybody that has anything to do with grocery knows Donald. As a matter of fact, <laughs> Donald just received an award 
from Minnesota Grocers Association Industry Ambassador Award back in April. I got the award. Oh my gosh, this is so amazing. I hear you gave an incredible speech. Yes, too. I did. What was that about? It was about the, the lo love of the grocery store industry. And it was, and I also plugged in because it was National Autism Awareness Month in April. I also said stuff about autism and I have autism. We should show support to everybody that works in the grocery store that has yeah. disabilities, so not just Asperger's yeah. or autism, but yeah. everybody in That's the right. disability community. People maybe think it's a chore to come grocery shopping. Why should they think differently? It's, it's the heart of the community. You meet your neighbors, you meet your friends. Families come and shop there with their kids, all the things. Yeah. I love everything about that. And the, fr the, fried, the fried chicken. chicken. But yeah, I like to get in on the fried chicken. Let me tell challenge. you what—that's no joke. You have to—you got to be on your game as a shopper to know when the chicken's coming out at the grocery store, because you miss that window and you're not getting the like best the crunch stuff. Yeah, when you bite into it's it. It's a. It's a game, a fun fact, uh, many Saturday and Sunday mornings, I will get the Zing's wings from Cub straight out of the chute when they come out uh, somewhere around 11 o'clock. And I just sit in the Cub parking lot and I just destroy Does about 10 Does your family you ways. do this? Nope. That's my special time. Your <laughs> special time. Uh-huh. It reminds me of my special time when I downed a cheeseburger and two orders of fries when I was pregnant in the parking See, lot. See, there you go. Five uh, eyewitness More fun building. facts for Minnesota Live. Too embarrassed Minnesota to come Live. and eat it in front of people. Yeah. There you go. Hey, Grocery Store Fanatics has more than 5,400 followers. They're at a different store, Kowalski's, Cub, Hy-Vee, you name it, all over Minnesota every single week. You'll find a link to give them a follow on Facebook on our website, minnesotalive.com.